Hi, Karen here, and today I'm showing you how to create your Facebook business page in less than five minutes. Creating a Facebook business page can help you raise awareness on your business, but also reach new customers and retain existing ones, whatever your market and whatever the size of your company. Only to have access to the same features as your personal Facebook, like posting content and interacting with customers. But you will also have access to tools to manage your Facebook ads and promotions and detailed statistics for tracking your page's performance. So if you ever want to create a Facebook page, I'll show you how in five steps. I'm gonna assume you already have a personal Facebook account. If not, you need to create one beforehand, but don't worry, it takes less than two minutes. Facebook accounts are set up differently, but normally you will have kind of the same interface than me. So you should find the page option on see more on the left of your feed. Once you've clicked on page, all you have to do is click on create a new page and you're done. Okay, now we need to find a name for our page. In general, you use the name of your company or product or service. So it's up to you to fill up the blank with whatever you Need. You'll also need to choose the category of your page. I'll leave it up to you to choose what best suits your company. You can put in several categories if you're not into one in particular. Don't forget to write a short bio to describe your business. This will help people who discover you via Facebook to find out more about what you offer. If you don't feel inspired right now, don't worry, you can update it later. Once it's completed, you can click on create a page. So far, so simple, isn't it? Next, you need to fill in the information about your business. Generally speaking, when you create a new page, you already have this information. So it's up to you to add your website, company phone number, contact email address, physical address, and opening hours. Depending on your business, you may not have all this information. After all, if you're self-employed, you may not have a website or a physical address or even working hours. Don't worry, you don't have to fit it in. Once it's done, click on next, and we'll continue with the addition of a profile picture and a cover. If you don't already have a profile picture and a cover made for your company, make sure you use photos representing your business and that you have the right to use these pictures. You can't steal pictures from the internet without permission and it will make your business look bad if you're caught red-handed. At this stage, you can add an action button. This will direct your visitors to the action of your choice by clicking on the button. It could be a video demo of your services, a ticket sales service if you're selling tickets, anything you like. After that, you can skip the following steps, but you can add your WhatsApp for simpler contacts. You can also invite your friends to like your page to boost its visibility. And finally, you can decide how you want to receive notifications from your page. Once this is done, your page is created. Facebook offers you a tutorial on how to use it, which I recommend you follow. Now, all you have to do is set the final details. Start by writing a welcome post to engage with your new followers. You can link your WhatsApp account at this point if you didn't do it before, but also connect your Instagram account and update photos. The choice is yours. And that's it. You've created your free Facebook business page in five steps and under five minutes. I let you an article in the description with a lot of tips for your Facebook Pro page. If you like the video, consider subscribing. It's always a pleasure. And of course, if you have any questions, I'm waiting for you in the comment section below. See you soon for more videos.